You're watching ZTV. Hello, dear ones, and welcome to ZTV. This is Z. I just want to talk to you real quickly about um, honor and faithfulness. You know, I was out running the other day and I picked up a penny. I always pick up change when I find it wherever, but when I'm out running, I always pick up change and things like that. And I was saying that on my Facebook page that after a month of running and picking up change and stuff as I'm doing it, I always have more than a dollar just sitting on the little dresser where I set the money, you know, from somebody else's foolishness. And the reason I call it foolishness is because they're perishing for a lack of knowledge. You know, sometimes you lose change and, you know, you can't control that. But a lot of times people throw change. Like I've seen people throw change. I've seen people drop change and not pick it up. But you have to remember that I broke through in the financial realm by sewing pennies. You know, that's that's quite an amazing testimony and a quite amazing truth. But it's what I did. I broke through sewing pennies pennies because there were times when that's all I had you know um, I also referenced David's um, quote from the Psalms when he said if I had not been afflicted I would not have learned to love your law I've learned to love the Lord's law because of my affliction because I came to that place where I had nothing and I was so poor that pennies seemed like millions of dollars to me I learned to honor those pennies you know by giving them to the Lord to the work of the kingdom it's so funny um, people think pennies don't amount to anything but all you need is a hundred of them and then you get you know a dollar so you, you should value them they're still money and not only that but Luke tells us the Lord said if you're faithful with little things you'll be faithful with much if you can't um, honor him with pennies he's not going to bless you with millions because you're not going to honor him with that either you know and that's the thing like a lot of times and people always want to say I talk about this in Revelation is for elevation people always say well there are people in the world who have millions of dollars well what does it profit you if you gain the whole world but you lose your soul you know the thing about finances with the Lord it's always about your heart it's never about anything else what are you doing with the provision that you're asking him for get Revelation is for elevation it will really bless you but think about that you know if you disrespect pennies and the money even says in God we trust you know that's another reason even before I was at that place where I was sewing pennies I used to pick up pennies and stuff off of the ground because the money says on it in God we trust you know that was one of those things I was thankful for and even being a teacher when we would say the pledge every day I was thankful that we still got to say you know one nation under God every time we finish the pledge I'd always be like thank you Lord that we still get to say that you know my kids would be looking at me and stuff like that but that that's just how it is you know if you can honor the Lord with something small but you better believe he can trust you with something big think about that you know, think about all of the small things that you've honored and how they've paid off for you. You know, the Lord does everything with increase. He's able to do exceedingly abundantly above all you think, hope, or imagine. So if you can learn to bless him with your pennies, you better believe that he is more than able to bless you with billions. Okay? And I'm a witness of that. All right. Take care. God bless you. Love you.